Sri Lanka. It's another decibel podcast time, and this time around, I've got a team, and uh, you might know these faces because they're very familiar from our uh, techno scene. I've got Ohm, and I've got Sulo, and Solo. Solo, right? Solo, yes. Hi. Solo. Uh, yes. And I, sorry, yet to Nadil know J. you. Hmm? Nadil J. Nadil J. Uh, very familiar name. So I've been Where do we know you from? From mostly Secret Pearl. <gasps> That's what it is. How are you and guys? Seeing double as well. It, it, it was an event. Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Uh, seeing double. That's a very familiar name. That was uh, recognized by the Kapanin Co. Which me and all back to back. Okay. Oh, cool, cool, yeah. cool. So, how are you guys feeling today? It's been like a really, really long time. <laughs> Oh, I'm feeling good. <laughs> feeling exhausted. <laughs> but yeah, we are good. We are good. We are full of energy. We served the one word answers today. So. Man, long Saturday night, huh? <laughs> yeah, indeed. <laughs> it, was, it was a bit of a Saturday night, yeah. For, uh, a, for Om and me and then uh, Nadil anyways had a good night's sleep, like I guess. Yeah. <laughs> morning and like all of that, yeah. But hey, man, listen. Everyone needs to have fun. Even the DJs need to have fun. Otherwise, what's the point, right? Exactly. Yeah. Live fair, a little, fair, yeah? Fair, fair, fair. Yeah, how are you like a fun maker when you can't even have some fun yourself? True that. But it, it's a lot of responsibility when you're ma having fun for other people, like making other people have fun. When you're having fun, it's just very easy. <laughs> when you put it that way. Because yeah. a lot of people are like, oh, you know, like I'm a DJ. I, I just have a lot of fun uh, playing for other people. But then what about you personally? So, um, well, take it. I mean, it's all the same to me if there's music uh, loud system i don't care if i'm playing i don't care if i'm on the other side You're i just, just like fun. i just like being there i'm not even necessarily having fun i just like music like, okay uh, <laughs> honestly so this is something you can tell your dj friends go fun yourself <laughs> if they ever decide to go on a holiday <laughs> <laughs> and 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 you guys have something massive coming up after dark lionsgate but uh, after dark this is your project right solo um yeah, yeah, so uh, we started After Dark, I think, last year. Hmm. So uh, this marks the first anniversary, I think, we've spoken about <coughs> in the previous. Yes. Uh, so we've spoken about a previous meetup as well. So uh, this time I'm partnering up with Gum. So basically, Om and Nadil are uh, basically spearheading that project with me. Uh, so we want to do something different, as I specified earlier as well. So it was always been uh, underground music, underground music, particularly labeled underground music. So we are bringing few genres together and okay. making it an experimental one this time uh, basically underground music capturing progressive house and predominantly techno as well so uh, oh the finally artists, a gig yeah. with the two yes so uh, the artists we have are very unique for this particular uh, matter because they are subject matter experts and they're very fluent and very fluid in terms of their genre transitions also so um, it's a powerhouse of artists to be honest and people who are like take music very seriously so it's going to be a new fun project uh, and uh, we've been actually working our asses out for that so uh, off, off for that so like uh, it's going to be amazing hopefully yeah yeah so after dark this is your baby and uh, now it's the two of you as well or is this just like a partnership for now no we're gum so like okay yeah so gum's gum, like huh? yeah i like that name yeah gum Gum. I can tell you what it means, but you'll have to like sense it out. Uh, okay. It's good underground music. <laughs> so yeah. Good underground music. Yeah, basically, uh, we just wanna like help people host events with good underground music. So see, get a hold of them <laughs> for your next project. Get a hold of them. It's kind of aimed at see, like I think Sri Lankan electronic music. The sphere of Sri Lankan electronic music has like a certain flat to it, mm. and. I, I don't know, maybe it's like the progressive elements, but even the techno they used to play here like some time back. It always had this sound, it was so like full and powerful. So like a lineup like this at After Dark, right? It's it's kind of like anyone can get into it, you know? And it's not it's not a very um, I guess it's just a natural transition that's gonna yeah. go from like progressive to techno. It's it's a sound, it's not a genre thing mm. actually, yeah. So now you know Sri Lanka. So this is one of those collaboration efforts. It's going to be epic. Yes. And, and, and tell us everything we need to know about the event that's going to go down. Okay. Um, whoa. 
October is not so far away. Yes, so uh, we, had dro- we dropped the bomb uh, a few weeks ago. <coughs> uh, it's going to be on the 12th of October uh, at the Rabbit Hole. Uh, sorry, the, the White Rabbit. The White Rabbit. Whoa, there's a place called White Rabbit in Colombo? Rabbit hole, White Rabbit. It's a rabbit hole, sorry. Yeah, yeah. yeah we, all, we hole, almost like hole. fumbled the fly as well uh, because of white rabbit, rabbit hole, you know, and all that. But yeah, <laughs> it's a, yeah. Dude, rabbit hole, huh? That's a new place. Yeah, that's an upcoming coming, uh, coming new place. Uh, they have uh, like, uh, they've done Saturday. few events. Carcade. Yeah, it's a target independence. Oh, yeah. okay, okay. Is this like ah, formerly known as asylum? asylum? Oh, asylum. okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. <laughs> Finally, they named it something a little more fitting than yeah. Asylum. That's exactly. like, so... Asylum is pretty fucking sick. It is, but in 2024... I mean, I'd go there. Okay. <laughs> I think... I mean, given the I reputation the of the place, though... Twice long no, but ago. you do realize that... Was it a hospital or was it like a place where they treated a lot of people with mental illnesses way back in the day? It, it was... It ah. was an actual asylum, actually. Okay. That, that oh, really? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> really. Yeah. But you know that. Wait, wait, I could be totally wrong, though. Like, as, as far as I know, I was told this. Like, I don't know if it's true, <laughs> though. <laughs> no, but see, <laughs> there... I thought about it. <laughs> like, it's never been something I think about, so like... But yeah, here's like, the we thing, We know Arkham Asylum, that's the only asylum <laughs> we know, right? <laughs> <laughs> but there were uh, two buildings, I think they were renovated at the same time. The Dutch Hospital, as well as this. Yeah, uh, Dutch Hospital, we kind of know that it was a hospital because of the name. <laughs> but like the other place, uh, Arcade Independence Square, there's no indication of what it was before. Some people say it was a hospital. Some people say it was like a place for um, treating people with mental illnesses. Yeah, I heard the mental illnesses thing. Yeah. So yeah. we are basically doing the same thing again, curing, curing people with uh, music, I guess. Yeah, yeah it's fitting. And it's fitting, the location fits, right? <laughs> and you know what? It's uh, Halloween month. It's so yes, Halloween, yes. Yeah, is it? Oh, yeah, it is. October, yeah. my dude. And, and October and beer, and beer month. There's a beer fest as well. Yeah. Oh, October fest. Yeah. yeah. What does that mean? Does that mean at After Dark we'll be getting like some cool deals? Yes, yes, yes. So we've partnered up with a few brand brands actually this Ooh. time. Uh, uh, we have a uh, few sponsors also. So we our team have been working day and night for that those things. Um, um, in terms of um, the merch, we're actually issuing uh, anniversary merch this time. Uh, we got some nice, uh, cool After Dark T-shirts. Woo! Right now. They are rapping. Uh, <laughs> so uh, the pre-sales ticket would get you that. So um, it's free of charge. So like until stocks last. Uh, and then uh, separately, we have um, uh, the brand Woken who are sponsoring us for this. So big shout out to them, uh, and also um, a few other brands as well, uh, like uh, Green Blends, uh, Island Pulse. Uh, what else? Uh, we got um, we got some like therapy as well, right? yeah, uh, green therapy for a uh, tattoo mm, giveaway. Ooh, fancy! Ticket giveaways as well. Three oh, yeah. and you yeah. guys yeah, have true. something else, right? You wanted to do like yeah. a little shout out? Yeah, we, do, um, we usually we don't do this on Decibel, but we're making an yeah. exception for you guys. We got uh, Fancy tea. from uh, Green Blends. This is Ooh. red hibiscus tea, and this is caramel tea, I guess. And we got some smoking blends as well. And this is called Ecstasy like. Premium. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that's a tea. Yeah. No, uh, oh. this is a smoking blend. Okay. Actually. Yeah. Yeah, I've heard good things about smoking blends. Yeah. yeah it's Apparently, it's, it's very. You know, people are substituting that for a lot of uh, tobacco and all of that. By the way, we can. Give it to Yasmin. Yeah. That's okay. You got a free. Hey! Yes, I get free merch. I get free merch. Yeah, free merch. Woo! Free merch. I love free merch. <laughs> So, uh, Thank you for this. You're very welcome, man. <laughs> Just uh, see whether it, 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 like you know, it's your like you know thing. I'm sure it yeah. will. It's black. <laughs> <laughs> That's number it's one. Dark. <laughs> <laughs> and 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 so you you didn't um give us the deets on the lineup. Uh, Who yes. is dropping sets? So uh, Om and Nadil will be playing. So these two have a unique blend of music together. They have even massive powerhouse of music. A uh, few big names: Rajit is playing. Uh, Yomal is playing. 
uh, and then uh, we have a female artist this time representing After Dark. Faz is playing. She's a very good progressive, up and coming progressive artist, house artist. And then we have Jason, who's been throughout with us. Debut from After Dark, he's also playing this time. Um, Sanashio, uh, a new name, uh, one of the uh, few DJs in Sri Lanka, I think, who are into Afro, Afro House, and uh, Afro Tech right now. So he has his own blender music. So he's playing. So we basically, we are curating a mixture of progressive house, mm. groove, techno, uh, Afro, Afro, melodic, um, disco. or disco. Uh, Nadil is a big fan of disco, myself included. Disco, disco. And but this is own. not like the. So, like, <laughs> you know, it's going to be a different vibe. So, perfectly curated to take you on a journey. So I, when you say journey, I would like to add that uh, with this project, uh, GAM team has actually worked so hard in terms of like, you know, all these other events. I'm like, we see events just to fly or something. So this time we wanted to curate a backline, uh, the storyline, story uh, create some characters and then create a unfolding of a story kind of way. Even our uh, uh, communication, our promotions, our, our, our material artwork, hmm. everything resembles that. There's a purpose. Uh, there's a story behind everything. So uh, I hope that the, uh, the uh, audience, the audience would love actually it. notice it and see it. And uh, we wanted to do something different in terms of artwork and our, our artwork stands out from that, especially the art, like uh, Om handled the creative direction of it. So kudos to you, man, on that. And well, job well done, this team was killing it. And uh, I was just uh, behind the lines, you know. Uh, so much work uh, was done by them. So uh, yeah, we put a heart and soul into this. <laughs> I can imagine, yeah. I see what she's in there too. Heart and soul. <laughs> oh, man. It goes with the flow. <laughs> Man, so s from uh, the time you had like the last After Dark party till now, what's really changed? So uh, we, we were uh, picked up by um, a few foreigners and invited to play music in the South. And then we got like, we, we, we forgot everything else and we were playing music in the South for a good six months. I know. <laughs> you know that interview we didn't have time to do anything released. else. Yeah, yeah. yeah obviously. To do the one we else. did. Of course. Yeah, and I was talking to Om uh, and Nadil about this project for a few months actually. Uh, and we originally wanted to name it Paranormal Agenda, but then we thought we'll do a mains uh, with a different theme and an afters with a different theme. So an afters is also coming. Uh, we'll drop in more Ooh. details about it along with, along with that. Um, uh, so yeah. You know, a lot of people tend to like uh, demand for like an after party and yes. like an after after party and then an after 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 party. Are you guys going to be doing that or this is just like one um, of those parties that's like straight up, okay, this is what we'll it see. is, it ends. Yeah. Well, oh, we'll see. Many surprises along the way, right? Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I mean, life is just parties for us, I guess, like, because like all we do is like we work on parties, we. Oh, Om is in a different syllable right now. He, he's in a very spiritual, <laughs> guided. Bro, like uh, yeah, like you know. <laughs> I'm far away from anything right now. Actually, you know what? He's just zen. <laughs> he's zen. He's zen. So zen. Today, you're actually very zen. Yeah, because usually you're a little hyper and all that. Today, you're like zen. I think it's fitting because today's a Sunday after all. Yes, exactly. Hundred <laughs> percent. Sunday fun day. Hey, as cliche as that sounds, it, it is what it is. <laughs> and uh, is there anything that you guys want to add in closing? Actually, something unique with blends of genres as well. So it's gonna be like progressive techno, minimal techno, afro. So all the fans can come and like Good take time. place in this event and have a Good time. time. Can enjoy the music as well. Yeah, okay. I guess that's it. One more question before I let you boys go. You know how crazy big our progressive scene has gotten, right? Like, literally, we've had how many label showcase? Showcases? I think around four already. Three, three yeah. Three. The fourth one is on the way. On the way. Mangali. Wait, is it four or is it three? Uh, three, I think. No, the fourth one is coming. Sudbeats? Yeah. Outer Limits. Soundgarden, Sudbeat. That's it, right? Uh, and now uh, Mangoli is coming. Uh, <gasps> Mango gen gen Alley! Generic gen 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 Beats are doing Mangoli. Ali just said... Uh, December, I think. Yeah. yeah, yeah. What do you guys think of all that? All that. Very all good. That it's very good. Uh, if quality music gets played in Sri Lanka, making it a hub, we are all for yeah, it, right? That's true. Yeah. I mean, like, we are not about any genres. We are not about any labels. We don't like gatekeeping anything. So uh, we like whatever that's going to be explosive to be explosive, and for the people to understand what kind of music they like. So I'm like, we can't limit anything like that. I'm like, it's not right. So like. 
it's progressive. Yes, I'm a big pro progressive fan myself. I'm a, I started to play progressive, like moved into a different genre, so I still play a lot of progressive, right? With my music, uh, and Omu even plays a lot of progressive. Nadi plays a lot of progressive. Yeah, so I started from progressive as well, and right now I'm playing like a bunch of genres, so not to like Kato anything, so rather than like sticking into one well genre, like just like come and enjoy the good mm, music that's it the problem is it doesn't matter how good like the lineups are like individual DJs are the the scene is just like one genre all night you know and like the first two hours at a party is like super fun if the music is good but even then it just like flatlines you know so like I guess how we do it in the south is like the party ramps up so it's a gradual thing I don't know why it doesn't happen in Colombo but over there it's just sensible like to start slow and then go like explosive like you said so that's something we believe in like mm. one thing I cannot personally stand is a party that sounds the same from start to finish like disgusting uh, so over here there's a progression and there's like a sensible like th the mm. lineups are curated in a sensible way so you know it's gonna be fun it's not gonna be like one thing the whole night you know variety that's what they're bringing yeah and uh, has this government made it easy for you guys to like do an event? Uh, it's too early to tell, but from the looks of it, I think uh, I mean there needs to be a certain uh, uh, functionality behind it. I mean, like most of the events that we are doing, uh, like I, we don't know like what happens to the proceeds or like taxation and all that thing. So I'm pretty sure these things will change in the future, right? Uh, like even we are like also like in registered companies and all that, so like we understand how this works. So hopefully, it's going to be better. Uh, understanding the key valuables, variables at play here when it comes to Sri Lankan music scene, not tarnishing it, trying to bring it up, maybe yeah. cultivate it a little bit more. Yeah. Uh, so that's that. Um, and uh, so um, even uh, for the after dark, like what we are trying to do, the theme, all those things will be visible at the venue. So I invite all the people who are interested, enthusiasts of uh, all the genres of underground music to come over, witness what we're doing there. Um, it's something different. We are not following a norm. We're trying to create something new. Uh, so it's, out of, it's out, out of alignment, but in a good way. So um, we are trying to create some chaos, you know, guys? Yeah. Yeah. Ah, like bring chaos some, uh, is good. Chaos inside productive, over here. Productive, productive chaos, you know. Jai Veva to you guys for like coming and uh, doing what you guys do. And thank you so much for the Thank you so much for <laughs> <laughs> Thank yeah. you for having us. Having us. Yeah, sure. You're a rock star, you know that, right? You do. All three of you. Wait, wait, I have a question for you. Yeah. Are you coming for ah, the event? Good one. <laughs> ah, good question. I'll have to see my schedule, my dude, because things they change so often. We'll send you a car and everything. That's fine. You know. Yes. We'll just be picked up. Yes. Oh, car. Oh my gosh, I have a car. No, an Uber bike would do. I'll send you a chariot. <laughs> no, no, Uber bike, please. <laughs> Two horses and a chariot. No, no, I don't support animal cruelty. Sorry. Why did you bring that up? Chariots. <laughs> it's a chariot. Okay, we'll dude, pull it's the chariots. Don't worry. We'll, pu we'll pull the chariots. That's fine. <laughs> you know what? I'll make like a human. I'll make two humans pull the chariot for you. That's better, is it? <laughs> <laughs> Awkward. Awkward. No, but Uber Moto. Yeah, we'll I'll settle for an Uber Moto. Or a chariot. He still wants me to come on the chariot. <laughs> Giddy up, human. It's a fucking night, dude. It's a night on the posters so or a chariot. Sticking to the. Giddy up. That's okay. Jai. I just like messing with Yasmin sometimes. <laughs> this is normal. This is very, very, very normal. <laughs> Giddy up. <laughs> so, see you guys hopefully on the 12th. On the Woo! Yes, thank you so much. Sweet. Let's kick the bucket. Yeah. Thank you so much for having us. <laughs>